Hi, this video is about how to add tails to fonts. This font that we're using for the video, it's called Brehana, and I downloaded it for free with a commercial license included in creativefabrica.com. If I go here to this picture, I can show you that Brehana has regular fonts with no tails, and you also have the option of using tails in the front or in the back of each letter. Now, how do you add those tails to when you're working in the design space? In my Mac, remember that it's different for a computer, a Microsoft, or a Mac. Some fonts allow you to just add a, a specific uh, caption in front. For example, sometimes it's a line or a uh, star, and it will change the letter. But with Brehana, it doesn't have that. So what I do is I open a phone book, and I go to Brehana, and I have all the the characters of the all the, le the letters here you see this one has the tail in the front and then up here it has you no know, tails so what you're gonna do is you're gonna have design space open and you need to have the square for the text you know when you go like that and you have this you need this open because you're gonna grab your your let your fonts and you're gonna bring them to this square if you just bring them to the to the canvas nothing is gonna happen so I'll show you an example Let's start with a lowercase h with a tail. Here's one. So I'm going to bring it all the way here. And then I'm going to get, let's just use the regular e, which I could go ahead and, now that I think about it, just write it. I don't have to do it this hard way. And then let's find the L with the tail. The L has two tails. It has this one or it has this one. I'm going to go with one of this ones. And then I'm going to use a regular L. And now I'm going to use a tail, an O with the tail. Here it is. So I'm going to go ahead and bring it here. So as you can see, we have these fancy letters. Because if I go ahead and write hello like that, it's not going to give me the tails that I want. So now it's just a matter of ungrouping and uh, placing the letters where you want them and just at the end welding. Okay, so for example, you have this, and now we're going to weld and as you can see, here are several examples of how you can use the tails in different ways to write the same word. Okay? If you have any questions, just go ahead and DM me a message through Instagram. Thank you.